we got a battle of top 20 wrestlers here at 157 pounds from the University of Missouri coming in ranked 15th in the nation, Joey Lavalli. He's in the red singlet, red ankle band, coming in at 13th, 12th ranked, Luke Smith of Central Michigan in the maroon singlet and green ankle band. We've got a good bout on our hands here. Joey Valley working for head position. Luke Smith got wrist on the right side. Valley getting low, checking, checking Smith's stance. Smith working that wrist. Valley keeping good head position. Now Smith tries to jack up that underhook. Both guys fighting for inside ties here. The valley circles right, shoots left. The valley looking misdirection, low single, but Smith keeps his hands low and doesn't allow it. collar on the right side for the valley valley collars hard fighting inside ties it's got a double collar tie very effective position Smith gets a fake palm to the face and fakes a shot. Valley moving his feet well. He's circling motion in and out. There you go. We've got an all Mac bout here. Mizzou versus Central Michigan. Beautiful left-handed high crotch for Lavalley. Sits Luke Smith to his butt. And this is where Luke Smith likes to be. Very good at scooting his hips and stepping behind. And that's how he won a semifinal bout. No score at the end of the period. Lavalley was in on that shot. But Smith defended well. Val gets the pick of the uh, second period, defers the choice to Luke Smith. Smith's going to take bottom. Deep half on the right side for Laval. Smith tripods up. Valley spirals him down, and a big lift in return. Ooh, Smith grandies out as he hits the mat and gets a one-point escape. 18 seconds of riding time for Lavalle. Valley looking for that left-handed high crotch here. Doing a great job moving in and out. Valley trying to get his feet moving, and Smith gets hit with a warning. Valley's definitely been the aggressor here in this bout so far, so not surprised to see Smith hit with a stall call here in the second period. Valley scoots his way into a, a high single leg, but he's got it. 
Luke Smith has his head down. He's got a, a wizard. Valley trying to hip in, cut that corner and get to that angle, finish a shot. Smith, great defense by Smith here. You're on the out of bounds line. See if the Valley can pull him back in and finish a shot. Smith's defense is incredible. He's just been defending so well this bout. The Valley's been in deep two or three times already and has not been able to cover any ground. Smart. Val is pulling hard on that head, getting Smith down to his. Four, three, two, one, five. And his time expires. Valley misdirection into a single leg. And this is an interesting call for the Valley. Is he going to pick bottom? Down by one? No, he likes to go neutral. He knows that Smith is dangerous on top. Both the Smith's last two opponents have avoided wrestling him on the mat. And much respect to Smith. He's a great rider. And he can turn guys for a living. And Valley says, nope, I'm going to finish this one on my feet. 1-0 lead for Luke Smith early in the third period. And the Valley's been pushing the pace. Valley doing a great job of putting two and three things together, moving his feet well, moving his hands well, and getting to his attacks. But Luke Smith will not falter. He's, his defense is just impenetrable so far. Those guys are done. Those guys got me as much as these guys. Valley's moving his feet, circling right. And shoots left, gets in deep on Luke Smith. He's got a high. And Luke Smith defense continues to be the deciding factor thus far in this match. He cannot crack the defense with Luke Smith. Joey Valley has been in deep several times and is still unable to finish. Attacked by Luke Smith and the Valley reattacks. Smith blocks it off. Now the Valley's jumping. Valley's, or excuse me, Smith is in the over-under position. Valley's got that body lock wrapped up, head in the chest. Now Smith is moving forward. 35 seconds left in the match. Smith brings it down to the mat, and he's trying to use that underhook. Now he's in on a high single. 20 seconds left in the match. And this looks like where Smith wants to be. But ref calls potentially dangerous. Luke, 14, We're at 14 seconds left on the rear attack. The Valley's been Smart. pushing the pace the entire match through all the offense, but he's been, yet to been able to score. He tries to throw Luke Smith down to the mat. And Luke yeah. Smith throws him. With a two-point takedown, he's going to be the victor at 157 pounds. 12th ranked Lou Smith is going to take out Joey Lavalle in the zoo. The Central Michigan Chippewa is going to get a champion here at 157 pounds. Good.